Okay, today I'm gonna be replacing my differential oil on my 1995 Toyota 4Runner. This is only a two wheel drive model, so I don't need to worry about the front differential since this one's not four wheel drive. Okay, so. Okay, that fits. Got the drain plug up here, uh, not the drain plug, the fill plug up here. I have to open that up first. Okay, after I got the breaker bar, after I used the breaker bar, this thing's able to loosen, oops, by hand. Uh, wait for that to seat down. Because there's some oil up there, I know that for sure. Okay, I do apologize for moving the camera a lot, but uh, good news is I got this thing out. I'm able to use the breaker bar with ease, and out it comes. Let me prepare for that to happen. And there goes all that oil. It looks like this thing has been recently changed since it's not totally black. Kind of a brownish color. But you know, I just want to keep this car maintained so at least everything's all lubricated and all good and stuff. So it's always nice to, you know, keep the car maintained. Do what you need to do with it. In order for your car to last a long time. And uh looks like not a long some excess debris has been in here for a while. So there were some shavings on, on this uh, uh, screw or this bolt because it's magnetic. And what it does, this one does, it's, it's supposed to get all that little shave, small shavings in the differential. That's why the oil's there to lubricate it. But if you see, if you see too much shaving, too much shaving on, on this thing then your differential is having a problem or your gear set inside the diff is having a problem but in this case it's not having that problem so far so I don't need to worry about it so as the oil is being drained here it's now getting close to three quarts on the oil pan so it looks like this person put too much on here the reason why I say that is my manual uh, my owner's manual says the oil capacity for the differential is 1.9 quarts. So that's about about two two quarts because I actually bought two quarts. So they possibly overfilled it. That's why the the fill plug was was seeping out of here. So yeah, the guy put the uh, the previous owner did put too much in there. I'm not saying they did a bad job at it. But this is the Toyota's. This is the Toyota 4Runner manufacturer specific. Um, this is what the manufacturer t tells uh, the owner, me, how much oil I should put on this differential. And the manual says 1.9 quarts. Some people like to fill this up uh, towards, uh, toward, to the point where it overflows. Some, which is okay. But I'm not in that in that league. I like to put. A little right amount maybe just a little bit more but not a lot yeah this is already a three quarts already on the oil pan but the manufacturer says uh, 1.9 but I have two I have two quarts of uh, ADW 90 so I'm just gonna put all two of it all two of them so at least we're on that you know safe side but I'm not gonna overfill like three quarts cuz I'm like I said, I'm not in that league. I want to uh, put diff oil, uh, put differential oil the same way that the manufacturer recommends me to do. So 1.9 quarts. Still waiting to drain this, this thing to drain out. So I'll be right back. Okay, it looks like we're 
we're going okay over there. So I'm gonna go ahead and just do this. Oh shoot, pinch myself, right. And then I can go ahead and grab socket wrench and uh, let me go grab it. there a little bit but you know it's okay okay let me go ahead and put the oil in like I said the manufacturer recommends to put 1.9 but I bought two quarts so I'll put all two in there and if you do just put this in there and just fill her up oil in there I need to do is just squeeze that that wasn't me Keep filling it till the bottle's empty. I swear that is not me. two quarts already in there like I said the manufacturer recommends I put 1.9 as I said that's two quarts manufacturer says 1.9 so that kind of went a little over but you know uh, two two quarts is one that one that 0 0.1 quartz is not going to hurt um, is that fill is there's a is that one spring okay it's still there okay. we're good good okay I guess I'll just throw away this old oil and call it a day <laughs>